Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new to my channel, my name is Ria Varsami and I'm a shamanic astrologer. Today I will be sharing with you astrological information based on shamanic astrology about the upcoming full moon in Capricorn, which is happening on the 3rd of July at 1.38 p.m. Central European time. That would be Berlin time or 12.38 p.m. London time. So this full moon is the most important full moon of the summer because straight after this full moon, uh, the lunar nodes on the 18th of July, they are changing axis, they are changing signs after 18 years. So we are now in the middle, we are closing an 18 year karmic cycle and we are stepping into a brand new 18 year cycle. So we have the, the lunar nodes, uh, the north node represents the collective uh, karmic destiny or when we study a person's birth chart, the life purpose and the south node represents collective karma or when we study birth chart, past life, uh, whatever we have to release, let go, resistance, etc. Uh, so we are in a very critical point with this full moon. We are in between, <laughs> we are in between the old and the new and uh, also we have um, a, lot of a lot of interesting aspects happening. So before I continue, if you're not a subscriber, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you can support my work and I can continue making these videos. So first of all, when we speak about uh, a full moon, every time we have a full moon is the peak of the moon cycle. Every time we start a moon cycle with a new moon, we set our intention and the full moon is when actually the cell opens the membrane and releases whatever toxic, whatever energy it doesn't need anymore. That's what we're doing. We're working like a cell because everything is connected, right? So now we're at a time when we release, we cleanse, we, we heal. And because it's an energy of Capricorn, it has to do a lot with structure. Capricorn is the archetype also of the masculine. It has to do with structure, with long-term plans, long-term goals, with ambition, uh, with achievements, with our public image, with press size, with work, business, all this is Capricornian energy. And the ruler of Capricorn is Saturn, the Lord of Karma, uh, which is now actually retrograde in Pisces. And uh, also Capricorn, uh, sorry, Saturn is connected uh, with uh, whatever uh, challenges, difficulties go through in this life in order to learn the most, to learn and to advance the souls. So the moon is doing a very good aspect with Saturn and sextile. So it's bringing a lot of karmic lessons to us, but not on a real, not on a bad or harsh way. It's bringing to us to really see, observe them, uh, examine them, understand them, and move on uh, to a new path. So it's doing it in a very positive way. More like I would say, more a higher perspective, uh, higher self way, more higher perspective. Uh, so this is a great time uh, now for breaking up uh, karmic. Uh, contracts, for example, related to Capricorn energy, relating with work, with business. So if you had some contracts with people related with money, with work, with business, collaborations, maybe you work for some people, maybe you collaborated. Now is the best time to break these karmic contracts and move into a new path. Also, it's a great time to work maybe with also uh, money blockages because it's very also much connected to this energy right now. So. Uh, and of course, when we break uh, karmic contracts with uh, this kind of, uh, let's say, business stuff, it can also open a channel for uh, receiving money after that, because this can create a blockage if there is there are some um, uh, stuckness. Um, so now the moon also is doing a very good aspect with Jupiter, which is the planet of expansion, of abundance. So this full moon also brings a lot of opening to new uh, opportunities. Uh, for us. Um, now also every time we have a full moon we have the moon doing an opposition with the sun. So the sun now is in Cancer and uh, the moon is in Capricorn. So this is very interesting because the Capricorn energy is the masculine and Cancer energy is the feminine. And the sun is masculine and the moon is feminine. So they are opposites. So let's say the, the moon which is the feminine is in the masculine and the opposite. So this is a time where we're really called also to find this balance inside of us, uh, feminine and masculine energy. And also because the sun does the conjunction with Mercury in Cancer, it's all about communicating our emotions, expressing ourselves, taking it all out, dancing, writing poetry, whatever way you have to express your emotions, going into the water, because emotions are water, and just expressing these, let it go out and uh, uh, release. Another important part of this uh, full moon also related to uh, karmic stuff is that 
Now we still uh, are in the axis of the lunar nodes now, the north node is in Taurus and the south is in uh, Scorpio. So as I said in the previous videos, we had an activation, uh, I think it was one month ago in the previous full moon in Sagittarius, where we had this, con we had this conjunction of the north node and the... Ah, uh, my brain <laughs> doesn't work now. <laughs> And yeah, and the and the North Node, uh, Jupiter and the North Node. So this activated our karmic destiny. So we're now already from the previous full moon, we are heading more towards our, our karmic destiny. So this now, uh, this uh, full moon is going to help us to clean any kind of blockages related to the Capricorn energy that stop us from going there. That can be anything. That can be money blockages that can be as I said contracts with people you worked in the past anything like that and also the south node which is in Scorpio right now and Scorpio also represents karma is also pushing us to release cleanse any karmic things that are not serving us anymore now so you might feel yourself you are in a very intense period right now or a very transformative period or you can also be in a period when you will just see all, this th all these things but just observing <laughs> depends uh, which uh, state of um, your uh, of your life you are right now so this is uh, this is for sure uh, now a time where we are moving to a new to a new energy and very recently i've been uh, i think it was three or four days ago i was uh, sleeping and i was receiving these messages all the time that now there is so much light on earth there is so much openness and we have the opportunity now to release the slavery program and as human race we've been as enslaved for thousands and thousands of years and now it's finally this program <laughs> let's say it's available for us to download it that we are actually free that we are creators that we can create like we come here to earth for that that's the experiment we don't come here to work nine to se uh, nine to seven no nine to five <laughs> i don't remember even the time of the the program <laughs> so yeah so this was also a beautiful information, so I really wanted to uh, to share with you. Another thing also about this full moon, because also Capricorn is a lot about structure, is a time also you might feel you really, uh, you, you, should, you have to restructure your life. Like maybe also see your life and see, is this actually the way my life is structured? Is it serving me or should I restructure it? This is also another thing that might rise uh, with this full moon. So that's what I want to share. This is a beautiful, beautiful time. I think we're all moving into a higher path with uh, this conjunction that happened with the North Node and uh, Jupiter. Now we have the Lunar Node changing signs. We have all this help from the cosmos to really move into a higher path. So also if you want to work one-to-one -one with me, I offer a variety of readings that can support you on your journey especially if you're going through transition and transformation right now or you want to leave your job and do something completely new I'm the person for that to help you to really find uh, what is aligned with you, with your soul and uh, if uh, you want to work with me uh, also uh, related to the full moon energy I offer a 30 minute full moon reading in which you will get absolute clarity of where you are now in your life what is happening now with your life, how this full moon affects you how to use this energy for your highest uh, good and path and how to understand yourself better through all of these uh, alignments that are happening right now. So thank you all so much uh, for watching and I'll see you very soon uh, in my next video. Bye for now.